Well, well, I just had one of the most awesome experiences of my life. That was so cool. I was walking down this trail here. This one, coming through those pines, walking all the way to here. And, and it's snowing lightly, and I get to this point in the road, and I look down, and there are the biggest set of bear tracks that I have seen in my entire life. I've been bear hunting for eight years, never seen anything close to this size. And uh, they couldn't have been any more than, at most, one or two minutes fresh. It was, it was snowing lightly, kind of like it is now, except it was snowing that kernel snow, the little, little balls, little pebble-sized snowflakes. And I came to these bear tracks, and there wasn't one snow kernel in any of the tracks. I mean, he had crossed the road seconds before I turned that corner. And I just got back from tracking him. I tracked him probably two miles down and and I never got caught up to him. It was, I tracked him through this forest here. So, I, mean, I was tracking these bear tracks less than one or two minutes old through dense forest in light to moderate snowfall. Man, talk about an adrenaline rush. Whew. Man, that was cool. That was fun. I had a bullet loaded in the chamber. I had of my rifle. I had one loaded in the chamber of my of my sidearm here just in case I needed to act fast. Cuz I was following his following his tracks down in there and there wasn't at any time I could see more than 10 or 15 feet in front of me. I mean, his tracks would disappear behind behind trees and I'd have to go behind that tree to see that they were continuing on. So every tree I came to, I I was thinking he was going to be right around that tree. I mean, monster bear, huge bear. I took some pictures of his tracks after I got back. So there I was tracking him probably two and a half, three hours. So they're old now, it's hard to see. I took a couple good pictures, but let me, let me turn around here. So, so there's one, and he's walking this way. You can see his tracks here, following on up. And eventually he went down into the forest there. And if you look at these things, I mean, these tracks are huge. And look at that compared to my hand. I, I've got 